purpose of this video is to demonstrate um, the way that objects display in the Visio group. I'm going to take a look at a uh, group of objects here. <clears throat> each one of these is, uh, shows visually uh, each object displays one above the other. And uh, it's, it becomes a little complicated in dealing with these objects. For instance, if we select um, this particular card right here, send this card uh, to the back, um, then move it forward, and bring it forward again. It would be pretty difficult to figure out where it is in the pile. Now this particular card, we can move this one to the top, but if we go to the, uh, bring it to the front, it puts it back into the right place. But as we work down in this uh, deck of cards, it's, um, it's hand, we see that uh, it would be pretty challenging to do that. Now, if we make a group of a few of these cards, I'm going to go to uh, Shape, Group. Uh, any new objects that are added, new groups, come to the front. So in order to get this uh, back into where it belongs, you have to take the group, uh, send it backward, 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 backward to get it right into the place where it belonged. But once we've done this and we've formed the group, uh, now when we move a card, uh, if we take like this number eight card and we send it uh, to the back, all the way to the back, it only goes to the back of that group. And uh, take it, bring it forward twice, and get it back to its regular position. So what happens now is, is when we move cards forward and backward, it stays within the particular group, which keeps them from moving all the way to the front or all the way to the back. Now, in order to, say, add another card to this group, by using the uh, Add to Group, we're now able to take that 9 card, go to Shape, Add to group. It doesn't move uh, to a new location. It keeps the group right where it was. So now this card is part of that group. So again, we move that nine card uh, to move it uh, to the top, which is where it is right now, and uh, bring it to the front and stay exactly where it is, which is within that group. So this is a way of using groups to uh, make management of uh, the display of shapes uh, a lot easier to.